Hi everyone, so welcome back to my channel and today I want to share with you guys um, my, my um, nine favorite perfumes that I reach for the most. Now I have a perfume collection but um, look, uh, what I'm going to do with that is once I get it all together and um, I'll make a video on that. But those perfumes are not, they're a collective uh, perfumes that I've collected throughout the years, but they're not the ones that I actually reach out for the most. So these that I'm going to show you today are the ones that are on my vanity, and those are the ones that I'm reaching out for the past, maybe past year. Okay, so let's go. So here I have um, stage for you guys, the perfumes that I'm using. And I'm going to start with the Jo Malone Pomegranate. And um, this one here is called uh, Jo Malone Pomegranate, Pomegranate Noir. And it is 3.44 ounce. And as you see, um, I've used it, it looks like I've used it a little bit, but I have actually used this quite a lot. And this is a perfect perfume to put it by itself or if you want to um, mix it with, with another fragrance. Um, it, it does really good with um, paired up with, some, with something else. So this is from John Malone. And then here I have my Michael Kors Very Hollywood perfume. And this is one um, point full uh, ounce. And this I got for Christmas. And I think it's in one of my favorite videos from um, the prior month. Okay. This one here, and I can't believe that I'm going to show you this. This is from Britney Spears, and this is basically a drugstore store, uh, perfume, and it's called Radiance. Okay, and this one is one, uh, 0.5 ounces. Really uh, fruity. It's kind of fruity, sweet scent, but not overpowering. Here I have um, Daisy by Marc Jacobs, and this is actually a Sephora uh, roller perfume, and I'm sure you guys have seen these before. Um, what, what I've been trying to do lately is I've been buying them like this, um, and, and then I'm, I'm checking to make sure that it's compatible with my chemistry um, and that I actually like, like it before I actually want to invest on in something, you know, uh, this big. Because I've had that um, in the past where someone tells me, oh, this is a great perfume, and, and I'll go and I'll purchase it, and I'll spend 60 to $70, and then guess what? When I get home, it doesn't smell as good on me. So th um, if you buy them in a rollable, it was, it's, you know, it, that's, a, that's a great deal. Then I have here um, Love, Peace, Juicy, and it's a little rollable, and it's from Juicy Couture. Then I'm going to come down over here, and these are uh, my Juicy Couture. Now, I'm going to start with the Juicy Couture Couture, which is this one here. This one is one point, f um, one point full ounce, and this is what that looks like. Over here I have, I'm going to lift it up so you guys can see it. These bottles are beautiful. Um, they're made really nicely. They're heavy. And then they have these little bracelets and little, you know, trinkets over um, over here. And it's really cute. Um, some women actually take this out and they use it as a bracelet. Um, I, don't, I don't need that as a bracelet. So I, I think it looks very pretty on it. So this one here is the Peace, Love, and Juicy Couture. And this one is 1.7 fluid ounce. And this one is Juicy Couture. And this one is the first one that I actually purchased. It's a way bigger bottle than the other ones. And um, nice bottle. It's also kind of heavy. And this one is 3.4 ounces. And you can see that I love this. Now, all the, the fragrances that I'm showing you guys today are kind of sweet, girly scent. Um, but not overpowering. Um, it's not like sh the perfume sugar. Those kind of scents that are like really kind of sugary, um, I'm not into those kind of scents. I'm more into floral, um, sweet scents. Now, this one here, it's my solid Marc Jacobs perfume. And it's in a nice little compact. 
and this is what it looks like it has a little mirror and that I put on my makeup in my makeup bag so I hope you guys um, liked my video um, it's like I said in the beginning of my video it's not a, a make a perfume collection but it's basically what I tend to gravitate the most this is something where I just pick it up and go these these scents are very easy um, they're not nighttime scents they're more daytime daytime scents um, I'm not into the musky kind of um, exotic scents but I do have some sweet scents that are like for evening um, these are basically the ones that I pick up on the weekends when I pick up when I'm ready to go to work and just want something um, something nice and, and clean smelling this is what I pick up now I'm going to do a little outfit of the day and um, let me um, get up slowly so you guys can see. And I apologize guys, sometimes I'll do a video and I'll forget to show you guys um, what I have on. It's not intentionally, it's just that um, sometimes I just forget. So today I have a basic uh, cotton blazer. I bought, this, I bought this at Target a couple of months back. I have a black uh, sequins kind of flowy kind of... Uh, tank it's a uh, sleeveless okay and then I have these faux leather shorts I don't know if you guys can see this this is what this looks like um, the purse that I'm wearing today is this purse right here it kind of goes with the blouse but not really it's kind of sequency but this is a tighter sequency this bag is great um, it's very light and um, it fits a lot of things, but in itself, it's not that heavy. So if you put a lot of things, it's fine. And this is how I'll use it. And then I'm going to take off my shoes, and I'm going to show you. These little shoes are the greatest. Um, they're also a little sequenced, but they're kind of flat. And like I've said in other videos, I'm not a high heel person. I like my flats. Um, I'm 5'7", so I don't need the heel and it, it's very uncomfortable for me. I'm always on my feet. I'm always running and, you know, doing things. And I like to be comfortable. So these are pretty, and they're flat, and they're comfortable. And they're very light. Um, for accessories, I have my um, fossil watch. I have this, it's like a credit bangle with studs inside. Here I have another bracelet with studs and black lacquer. I have my MR Cheek. Um link black bracelet here I have a silver ring with a, a black onyx and um, some white um, uh, rhinestones and it's just like a silver here I have my wedding band and engagement ring no necklace today because um, I felt like I had a lot of going on here so I went very light on my neck and then in here I have just acrylic little post earrings um, I think this was like about $3.99 and Forever 21. And then my hair, I just picked it up in a, in a sloppy bun. That's it, guys. That's all for today. So um, thank you for uh, sharing another video with me. Uh, thank you to my subscribers. I, I, you do not understand how much it means to me for you guys to come along and join me in this beautiful adventure on YouTube. And please don't forget to subscribe. Um, comment on my video give me suggestions guys um, I'm sure that you guys have ideas I'm not, I'm not gonna be doing tutorials in this channel just because I'm not that great at it um, the makeup that you see on me right now um, everyone knows how to do makeup there's a lot of beautiful women out there doing YouTube's that do beautiful tutorials actually that's how I did my eyes I actually um, looked at some some videos and that's how I'm learning how to apply my makeup so I'm not a makeup tutorial person. So if you guys are th thinking that that's what this um, channel is going to be about, I'm going to tell you here. I have a lot of friends. I can link them below that they do wonderful tutorials. Um, I'm more of a fashion person, more of a decorating person, organizing person. And just basically um, whatever I, I know is what I'm going to share with you. Um, I'm going to leave the, the tutorials to the big dogs, um, girls that really know what they're doing. So, once again, thank you, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.